going on guys, I'm with Craft Table here and today I'm going to be showing you how to improve your download speed on Steam uh, when you're downloading Steam games obviously or whatever you are. Um, so first thing you're going to do is there's I'm going to show you two ways. One involves Cheat Engine, which you know, I'm using right now. Um, and you'll get a pretty huge improve. And then another one will, it could impact you or could not depending on how good of a computer you have. I have a pretty decent computer, so it didn't really do that much. But if you have, uh, if you're running off wireless, it definitely should help. And uh, yeah, so if you don't have a great, great computer, or you know, you just are getting really, really low, like below a megabit, um, this should help. If you are getting like two, like I usually, yeah, I usually get 2.5. Um, and when you do this, it doesn't help. But just try it and if it doesn't then you can try this way if you don't want to then I'm sorry but I don't know any other ways so let's get started so first thing you want to do is go into the top left corner and you'll see steam click on that go to settings wait for this pop up there you go go to your downloads it should be on accounts but just go to downloads and then what you want to do is here where it says download region use for me it was on um, it was on Charlotte which is kind of far away from me so I switched it to New York, uh, that's not um, New York, but yeah, I switched it to New York, and then you just hit OK. Uh, for you, you're going to switch it to whatever is closest to you, just find the closest state possible, and then you're just going to choose that, and that should help, <clears throat> so you're not like trying to go out from servers that are really far, and have to travel a long distance, and stuff like that, so it should help a little bit, um, but also at the same time, you have to think about how many people do you think are downloading from this place? Because the more people downloading from one spot is going to have it having to supply a lot of different people, making it so it will be slower depending on where you choose from. So to be honest, I don't know if that was a great decision. I'm not saying to change it right now <clears throat> to a place where I think why not have that many people downloading from Steam. Um, I'm gonna choose. Uh, I'm gonna choose Miami because that's totally bad. Okay, boom. Uh, you will have to restart Steam, so I'm gonna do that right now. There we go. <clears throat> I'm gonna see my just a little bit bigger. Kind of small, maybe for you guys. I don't know. Okay, but then the next thing you're gonna do is just go back to your downloads. And yeah. Now, it's gonna go up really, really high right now. I'm actually going to uh, close this real quick just so you can see my normal download rate. Because with this uh, cheat engine, that's what got me up to like 25 megabits. So hold on, I'll show you my regular. So I usually get around 2.5, just letting you know. I usually get around 2.5, 2.3, without doing anything. So I'm going to see how this uh, region works. If it gets higher, that's cool. If it doesn't, oh well. So it doesn't seem to be doing anything. It does seem to keep it from going down. That's great, but it doesn't seem to be actually going any higher or any lower. So it's just kind of keeping it at a solid rate, which is great. <clears throat> and that kind of rhymes. Oh, okay, there you go. 2.6. Not a huge difference. Oh, never mind. It went back down, but it does help what somewhat um, because, you know, I guess 2.4 is, you know, a little bit lower than 2.5, but not by much. So the next thing that we can do. <clears throat> you can open up cheat engine which to do that you just type in or well, you go download it but for me I'm just gonna type in cheat engine or just cheat if you already have it that's how you open it but I'll leave a download link in the description or you can just google it and get it from there so uh, what you're gonna do now is go on top left and you'll see this thing select a process to open it's a little computer with a magnifying glass click that find steam do not click steam service click steam.exe hit ok and then you'll get this and it will look like it didn't change but it did a little bit uh it's just cho chosen the process to configure so oh okay i guess it is going up by point one awesome so next you want to do is click in over here enable speed hack and then just enable this at point zero one i mean sorry zero point one i'm really sorry about that and then just hit apply It'll take a couple seconds to actually start doing something, but you'll see a dramatic change with really that. So let's just wait here for a couple seconds, and you'll see it start going up by a lot. There you go, and it just jumped up to point six point six megabits a second. And 
it should jump up again pretty soon to about 8, and then once it goes to 8, it should go around like, I think it goes from 6 to 8 to 14 to 19, and then to 20 and 25 or something like that. I don't know. It did something crazy. Okay, there it goes. 10. So it is going up quite fast. Um, so if you do really have some um, speeds, then you can do this. Um, but yeah, uh, by the way, don't think of this as megabytes. These are megabits, which are smaller than megabytes by a little bit. So just keep that in mind. Okay, so it's pretty close there now, guys. Also, I want to say, if you can hear my fan from my computer, I am deeply, deeply sorry. Uh, my computer is literally like a foot and a half away from me. And the fan, not too loud, but, you know, this mic, it might pick it up. So I'm just saying, if you can hear it, I'm sorry. I'm going to try to get it out. Um, and if I can, well, you know, good for me, but if I can, I'm really, really sorry for that. Nothing I can really do about it. Um, I guess it could set up my mic differently, but I didn't think of that till now. Alright guys, so it's almost there, not quite, but I think I'm going to end the video here. So if it did help you guys, make sure to drop a like, and if you aren't already, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.